So once the crumbed coated cake has had a chance to chill and the buttercream has firmed up slightly, we can then finish the cake and decorate it with the remaining buttercream. So the way I do it is to put the rest of the buttercream on the top of the cake and that way we can work downwards. So take your offset spatula again and then just gently smooth it out to the sides just so it's peeking out over the edges trying to keep it level and then we can work that excess down the sides of the cake to create a nice smooth top it's quite useful every now and again just to clean off your spatula just because it's easier to work with that way so once the buttercream is coming down the sides just smooth it down like that so it falls down like that. So all the way down. And because we've crumb coated the cake beforehand, it's not pulling up any crumbs, it's all staying in that layer below the frosting. Just keep working until you've got the cake completely covered all the way around. And don't worry if the frosting's peeking up the top here, that's actually quite useful, so don't worry about that. So once the cake is pretty much covered, you just want to smooth it from the base first. So the first thing to do is just clean up the edge of the, uh, the base of the cake. So just run your spatula, hold your spatula there, turn the turntable, just to pick up most of the buttercream like that. It doesn't have to be perfect at this stage. And to get a really smooth side, all you need to do is hold the spatula at an angle, so instead of straight onto the cake like that, you want to angle it off slightly, and then you're going to turn the turntable, keeping the spatula steady, and just putting a little bit of pressure on, so that as you turn the cake, you should get a nice smooth surface. So once the sides are nice and straight, you need to smooth the top. And this lip is quite helpful that we've created through the smoothing. What you do is take your spatula again and you want to hold it at the edge and then just pull in just so you've got a nice smooth surface like this and then just turn it around and keep doing this all the way around just to get it smooth and that way you get a nice straight edge on the side and a nice smooth top. And then just again, using the spatula, just gently flatten out the top, just to give it a nice smooth surface. And then you can decorate the cake as you want. But that is your smoothed out cake. So another way to actually decorate the cake once you've got it nice and smooth is to do a ripple effect. And you're just going to use the same offset spatula and you, all you're going to do is hold it against the board, against the cake, and then just lightly turn and then slowly pull it up until you get this nice ripple effect. For the top, you just do exactly the same, hold it from the outside edge, turn the table, and then just slowly bring it in into a spiral until you reach the middle, and then just gently pull up. 